hooked up. Need a load more coming out of it. Yeah. I've done up to damping flat block, four courses, put a damping underneath the joist, put a damping over the top of the joist, so we're double damped. There you have it. Uh, good morning. We uh, had to time travel a little bit because the GoPro died last night and we didn't have time to uh, change the batteries, so we'll give you the update on the next day. So, as you can see, it's all tidied up. All the acros... Acros were in at the start. What am I on about? The steel's in, the blocks are in, and all the walls taken out and tidied up. So plan today now is I'm going to get a mix on. Dad's going to get some uh, hot water for me. That kettle's got a pot boiling in there, you want to take that? Yeah, but I'll put that in the mixer now. because not too bad. Because it's currently uh, zero degrees. It was minus two when we left and it's got up to zero now. Yep, minus two when we left. So I just realised I need to grab this mic. So I'm going to get the mix on. I'm going to get this blocked up and then get the steel set in. Cut out a little bit for the pad stone. Little pocket for the steel and Yeah. And then then that's it. I think while I'm mixing, Dad's gonna give that a bit of a clean. Because it's very rusty, so it needs just a bit of a polishing up so the steel can weld on. And we've explained about the weld, haven't we? Yeah, we've explained all that, so. So yeah, that's the plan. Oh, and there's Dad's little uh, genius purchase. To keep all the bricks uh, from falling on our heads. But yeah, so enough dilly dallying, I'll get a mix on in this cold weather. There's the hero over there. With his Aldi hat on. Right, after break, got over our little hiccups. Um, still needed cutting down because the flange that's been welded on was just a bit too deep. So I've cut that down with the evolution saw. I've been up there, which you will have seen with the light, and prepped all that, ready for taking the weld. Right, there you go. And Alex took the door out. Tried to. No, we took the door out. So this is all ready to start with the block work now. Basically just straight up. We're going to put the steel in now. Get it with an acro so it's all sat ready to go. Put all packers in where the joists are because the joists aren't even. And then get the block work done. You just have to show me where the damp course all that's going. Yeah, we'll work, we'll work that as we go along. So we're going to put two damps in because there are two damps. Yeah. 
We might be just having to put one in, but we'll, we'll see. We've got the evolution saw, we do all the cuts. So we're just building it, we're not messing around cutting. Yeah. Once we know what the two, the, you know, once you've got two cores on, you know what all your cuts are. Yeah. So I'll put you somewhere while we get this steel in. It's going to go up, it's going to have an acro put under it for now. Jay and we're going to come and weld it later. And we're going to build this ending, and then we'll just leave it propped with two acros. Once the, once the steel's in with, under an acro, we can take those ones out. And we can put two acro, two acros underneath it then, and then everything can come out. Just repeat that it's been welded before someone says, "I'll oh, stop inputting properly." Mm. This is being welded. I mean, that mic. JM Steel are coming when, uh, like, in the afternoon sometime okay. one day, and they're going to weld it to that to that steel. Look at me, meet my gaze. It's going to get sorted. There's a piece of paper somewhere with yeah, the engineer specs. So it's under there somewhere. I'll show you that anyway. So, let's get this steel in. Yeah. We're filming. Filming, filming. Yeah. That's my, yeah, so they point it that way so it's better. Right, into the cupboard, back out. Right. Now, okay. so you've um, 
You hold it steady. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Taking the weight, we're going to put another two acros in, like a third of the way in, third of the way in, take that one out, and then everything supported. Then, ready for the weld to be done. I've got plenty of room to get around with the weld as well, so. Oh, yeah, that's nice. That we probably just want to knock it that way a bit. Get the big hammer on the end. part's touching. It's actually touching. Yeah. That part's not, but the middle part okay. is. I think it's just doing that a little bit. Yeah, it's not straight. What's good? The welds will fill the gap. Yeah. Okay.
and we're back after lunch, dinner, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Steelers in, as you can see, two props underneath it. All the um, brickwork survived thanks to that galvanised strap we put on it. We just need to pack up underneath the um, joists where there's gaps because once the joist starts creaking, we can use packers or wedges for that. Um, it's all ready for the James Steel to come in and get it welded. Plenty of good access for him there. And I've done up to damping the flat block four courses, put a damping underneath the joist, put a damping over the top of the joist, so we're double damped. Got four courses in, just got the rest of this put in now and we're, and we're done. Uh, all these three acros are going to be left until maybe tomorrow morning, probably sometime over the weekend. But anyway, we're, we're not taking them down today, we're going to come back for them. Not taking them down tomorrow either? No, we could do in the morning, but we'll see. So that's it. I'm going to put two pad stones in there because the steel is a bit long. Instead of cutting it, we're just going to extend the pad stone. I've got two there. Oh, I've got one there as well. I've got four. <laughs> so we'll mix and match and make the pad stone oversized. So yeah, that's it. We'll get back to it and get this block work finished.
see it there, just getting this last little brick put in, but that's done. It was a bit of a faff this morning, but we finally got there. Steel's up, put all the uh, doorways blocked in. It's all woodwork by his truly. And uh, pads thrown in. I'll give you a proper look around in a second. And we'll be back to show you this with the Atmos down and with the steel welded in, which I don't think is happening for Monday. It's about five days. Uh, like that. Tuesday today. Okay. Yeah. Which won't be over another six days, so no. until then. Wednesday yeah. today. What was it? Oh, yeah. five days. Five days, whatever. But um, so for now these aquas are staying in, keeping that thing extra secure while all the mortar goes off and until that last bit gets folded in but I'll give you a little walk around in a minute but I'll do a little wrap up while you can roll There you have it, all finished, all packed up, pad stones in, over 300 seat in there, and welding done. Both sides, acro's out. Jumps are good. So that was a tough one, but thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel and you want to see more of this or anything else that we do, be sure to hit that subscribe and tap on that bell for notifications. That way you'll know every time we upload. It's always a massive help and we greatly appreciate the support from the channel. This has been Brooklyn with Steve and Alex. With a very, very nice light lintel. And a very nice light steel and we'll see you in the next one.